Oklahoma is the only state that Obama did not win even one county in the last election. While everyone is focusing on Arizona's new law, look at what Oklahoma has been doing. Oklahoma law passed 37 to 9, an amendment to place the Ten Commandments on the front entrance to the state capitol. The feds in D.C., along with the ACLU, said it would be a mistake. Hey, this is a conservative state, based on Christian values, HB 1330. Guess what? Oklahoma did it anyway. Oklahoma recently passed a law in the state to incarcerate all illegal immigrants and ship them back to where they came from unless they want to get a green card and become an American citizen. They all scattered. HB 1804. This was against the advice of the federal government and the ACLU. They said it would be a mistake. Guess what? Oklahoma did it anyway. Several weeks ago, we passed a law declaring Oklahoma as a sovereign state, not under the federal government directives, joining Texas, Montana, and Utah as the only states to do so. More states are likely to follow. Louisiana, Alabama, Georgia, Carolinas, Tennessee, Kentucky, Missouri, Arkansas, West Virginia, Mississippi, and Florida. Save your Confederate money. It appears the South is about to rise up once again. HJR 1003. The federal government has made bold steps to take away our guns. Oklahoma, a week ago, passed a law confirming people in the state have the right to bear arms and transport them to their vehicles. I'm sure that was a setback for the criminals. The liberals didn't like it. But guess what? Oklahoma did it anyway. Just this month, the state has voted and passed a law that all driver's license exams will be printed in English and only English and no other language. They have been called racist for doing this. But the fact is that all road signs are in English. If you want to drive in Oklahoma, you must read and write English. Very simple. By the way, the liberals don't like any of this either. Guess what? Who cares? Oklahoma is doing it anyway. I think God, I live in Oklahoma, and I thank God every day that we have people in Oklahoma who are standing up for our rights.